urinary incontinence is one of the tiresome issues that many women in the 60 plus generation are confronted with. About 50. Before going forward hit subscribe button and press bell icon for notification of every upcoming video. Here are some tips for self-care to make you mentally and physically happier and to reduce the stress which burdens your life. 1. Take more sleep. One of the most effective ways to reduce fatigue is to have a good sleep. Try to have a nice quality of sleep by going to bed early and turning off any electronic and communication devices. 2. Creating an art form. HSP have the advantage of seeing details and connections between one thing and another. You can use this to create your own art, like music, painting, sculpture, anything. Turn those exhausting energies into your fuel to create. 3. Take a walk in nature. To reduce the effect of daily situations that make you feel overwhelmed, Try to take a walk in nature, or spend your time absorbing the natural scenery and fresh air. Taste the quietness as a catharsis for your tiredness. 4. Find other HSP and make friends with them. By finding other people just like you, you can share anything you can't tell to common people. They will understand your struggle, and they can also share your thoughts and experiences. This way you can reinforce each other. 5. Find your me time daily. After a busy and exhausting day, try to find a nice and quiet time with only yourself alone. Use this time to recharge and bring back the energy you lost before. 6. Food. Give your body good and healthy food. Because you need energy to fulfill your needs, don't let the overwhelming situations affect the food supply for your body. From healthy food, you can have a healthy mind and body to face the world. 7. Home Sweet Home Make your house become your place to retreat. If you still can't relax by the time you enter your house, maybe there's still something that's making you tense. Find these triggers and throw them away. They can come in many forms, such as bills, shopping notes, an old picture of your ex, the ringing doorbell which is too loud, a promotion letter of stuff you don't even need, etc. 8. Reading a lot. Books can be so helpful to keep you away from reality. Find a good book or novel that can keep your mind busy but happy. When you get lost and carried away by the story in the book, you are also recharging your mind. 9. Writing. Writing is like a best friend of reading. If you read a lot, you will have a good vocabulary and understanding. You can use this to make your own material and to make your own writing. By writing, you can have a better understanding of yourself and put your restlessness into a positive way. 10. Avoid or minimize external stimuli. When you get home, try to relax and avoid all the interference from the external world. It's a simple yet effective way to make you relax. Turn off your TV, lights and other things. If your fan or AC are too noisy, try to fix it or find a new one. This way you can have the calmness you need to recharge your energy. 11. Put aside your smartphones. Smartphones can become an energy drain for you. Put aside your smartphone somewhere you can't easily reach it. Turn off the ringtones by using silent mode. Avoid scrolling through unnecessary celeb gossip or cheesy news. You can find yourself happier when you're not fixed to your gadget. 12. Having a nice bath. Taking a good bath or shower can really help to ease off the tension you have all day long. If you have a bathtub, you can use a nice salt based on your favourite scent or you can use good warm water for a shower. 13. Playing with your pets. Pets can give unconditional love we miss in daily social life. Pets usually never ask for much in return. They don't hide their feelings or have unimportant chit-chat with you. 
You can feel relaxed just by seeing your hamster running around, watching the fish in the aquarium, or hugging your cats or dog, or any animals you like. 14. Taking care of plants. If you don't like animals, you can choose to take care of plants. Plants can give you the fresh air you need, and it can make your home feel more alive. There are a lot of plants you can choose, which are easy to care for. 15. Eat chocolate. Chocolate is really tasty and contains antioxidants which are useful for your body. You can taste the sweetness and any flavour you like. The taste will give you a really nice sensory experience. Choose the best quality chocolate such as a good dark chocolate you can find in the market. 16. Open your window. Open your window to let the fresh air come in, especially after a rainy day. Feel the sense of the windy breeze entering your room. 17. Walking. Take a few minutes to walk. By walking, you can absorb your surroundings and make observations of it to make it as your source for creativity. 18. Create a playlist of soft music. Soft music can help you to relax and forget the loudness you take all day long. Use your YouTube, Spotify, Google, or any platform to create your own choice of relaxing music. 19. Keep away from toxic situations and toxic people. We all have these kinds of environments or people who can be toxic, whether at the office or neighborhood. If you get stuck with these situations, try to avoid them or be firm to them by saying no. 20. Take a deep breath. One of the most effective ways to calm yourself is for you to take a good deep breath. There's a lot of deep belly breathing training on the internet you can find. You can use these skills in your daily life every time you need to relax. Being a highly sensitive person can sometimes be challenging, but you must remember that your mind and body should be taken care of. And the best person to take care of you is yourself. Give love to yourself take care of your body and soul. We hope these tips can help you to practice self-care and change the hectic and overwhelming conditions to become your potential to be the best version of you. Remember, HSP is special and there's nothing wrong with being a highly sensitive person. Well, the good news, women have a relatively large number of ways to remedy this. Pelvic floor training through gymnastics or on equipment, it's never too late for that. This improves or cures over 50% of those affected. Weight loss, even a 5-10% reduction in obesity is accompanied by a 60% decrease in urinary incontinence. Plant-based nutrition to increase the body's defenses and strengthen the tissue. Food supplements with silica, vitamin D, antioxidants. Drink a lot and don't think that if you drink little you have to go to the toilet less often and therefore have less urinary incontinence. You only promote bladder infections and risk deterioration. Medicinal plants can be used to improve the weakness of the connective tissue, for example, field horsetail, Schusler salts, homeopathic complex remedies, or constitutional remedies. Plant preparations and food supplements such as lingonberry or cranberry extracts, goldenrod, and barberry are also suitable for bladder care. You can also try homeopathic complex and individual remedies. The vaginal mud treatment, which you can do yourself at home, is another sensible option, as the blood circulation of the entire pelvis is improved and a vegetative balance is created. The weight, health tips for women and then of course the eternal problem with weight. When it was easier to lose a few pounds with a diet when you were young, it now means hard work. In addition, women 60 plus have to manage the balancing act between lowering their energy intake, while simultaneously increasing their intake of important phytonutrients and enough protein, and increasing energy consumption. This means gathering precise information about healthy eating, applying the knowledge, looking after the bowels, and lots of exercises. Due to the hormonal changes after menopause, the metabolism becomes slower, the body fat distribution changes and the calorie consumption is lower. Due to bad habits of the past years, slag, accumulates, the liver and kidneys become tired, so that the detoxification no longer works optimally. 
The intestinal mucous membrane is badly affected by fast food, environmental toxins, preservatives, and dyes, so that it becomes full of holes and poorly digested food components can pass through, which call the immune system on the scene. Inflammatory reactions and digestive disorders follow so that many women can no longer tolerate healthy food. Wheat or gluten intolerance is particularly common and far too rarely recognized in women. The body suffers from want what you can do yourself, change in diet, avoid short-term slimming diets. It is better and healthier in the long term to change your diet, avoid simple carbohydrates and too many animal products. Switch from white and brown bread to whole grain bread, from meat, sausage, and cheese to vegetables, legumes, lettuce, fruit, and healthy vegetable fats. Perhaps you will succeed in doing without all gluten containing products for 14 days on a trial basis e.g. types of grain such as wheat, oats, rye, baked goods, and finished products, etc. Then, as you start to feel better and lose weight, it will be easier for you to make friends with this type of diet. Green Smoothie – Replace a meal with a green smoothie. It saturates and supplies your organism with an abundance of phytochemicals that stimulate the metabolism, replenish the vitamin stores, and give the power plants of our cells, the mitochondria, new energy. Bowel Care – Without a healthy, well-functioning bowel, you will find it difficult to lose weight. The millions of intestinal bacteria not only help with our digestion but are also involved in the functioning of our immune system and in our mental well-being. So it is worthwhile to find out more about what is actually going on. Help from the vegetable kingdom. There is some help from the vegetable kingdom to help you burn fat more easily, e.g. B artichoke tincture. Bitter substances make digestion easier. Or a trick to fill you up faster, drink a glass of water just before you eat. Movement. Finally, energy consumption. Do not miss any opportunity to move. Exercise your circulation by walking quickly, walking or jogging, swimming, dancing, whatever movement you enjoy. Make a goal of doing real exercise at least three times a week for one hour, sweating encouraged. Use bikes and feet instead of cars and elevators as often as possible health tips for women, getting older also has its good points. In many women, for example, the psyche stabilizes. Calm and serenity are attributes that one often only attains with increasing years, and that has something to do with mindfulness. Therefore one can learn calm and serenity at any age. The sooner you start using techniques that bring you calm, the better, mindfulness exercises, breathing exercises, yoga, autogenic training, and more don't just think about your body, please also your soul, every woman will find her own individual recipe. Some like to dig in the garden and enjoy the plants, others wander in the forest, sing in a choir, play an instrument, paint, or devote themselves to the grandchildren. An animal can also become an important center of life, especially for single women, and donate daily feelings of happiness. However, studies show that first and foremost for the happy soul is being part of a functioning community and the feeling of being valued. Humor and laughter come naturally.